taking a look at stock ticker symbol MMEG over on investorshangout.com forward slash live. So uh, this one right here was in our stock contest, okay? That's why we're going to be taking a look at it. Um, InstaTrader, like I said, this price right here is from December 16th, uh, the close of that Friday. Okay, and this right here, uh, I'm going to say this just for these, uh, these top ones that we go through. Um, this price right here is from yesterday's closing price, which would have been the 20th. It was up 88%, uh, 188% since he called that off that price. So congratulations to him. Uh, this is definitely our biggest winner. Uh, we've got the runner up 96% and 66% out of 93 picks. So congratulations, uh, all you guys, especially the top, the top ones. So uh, this changes though. Tomorrow, it could be uh, uh, Mac over here all the way at the top with a couple hundred percent gain. So let's take a look at MMEG. Now, I've I, I seen a lot of people posting about this one over on Investors Hangout. It, as soon as uh, I've seen it up 188%, I, I went over here and I looked at it. And, and I mean, there, there's some stuff that it, that is a little concerning to me. Um, and just to be blunt about it, I, I know what I said right before uh, we started here that I felt this one was probably going to start pulling back and it was still green when I said that and it switched. So at 0027, okay, let me tell you what I'm seeing here as far as the chart. Everything started getting really close together right here, okay? You got above, it looks like right here I had a hard time with that 10-day simple moving average, okay? And it got through it right here the day before it started running on the 19th and then it just exploded on the 20th straight through uh today you had a gap up doesn't it doesn't mean that it's gonna you know tank down that's not what i'm saying here okay uh but you're probably gonna definitely fill that gap you're probably gonna in my personal opinion you're gonna close probably about 0024 um right around that area roughly if i zoom into this you got outside that upper bollinger band so it's gonna pull back in there okay uh, as I said that, you watch that gap being filled, and now it's right down there. It's at 0025 you know, area that I was just mentioning. So keep that in mind. You're probably going to pull back down uh, inside, if not about right there. Uh, it just gapped up today. That's the thing. I mean, there was so much interest in this one at 0026 that today it opened at 0029 so you have that gap up there so keep an eye on mmeg like i said uh, i mean it's a, a little too early to really get a good read on it because this thing went so tight here now right here if we would have been looking at it on the 19th i would have put this one on radar because it started working its way through but it blew through there but that was big gains i mean 180 percent it's not going to run forever so keep an eye on this one it might pull back for a day or two uh before it starts bouncing up joe was there anything recent on mmeg yeah, they had news on yesterday, actually, on 12-20, 2016. Momentous Entertainment Group, a diversified media company with a focus on technology that creates, produces, and distributes quality content across various media platforms, announced today that it has negotiated all points of the acquisition documents with the sellers of Poolworks, and Momentous has set the closing date at January 2nd, 2017, on advice of its auditing firm. Thayer O'Neill. So um, then it goes on to say, as previously stated in a press release issued on November 29th, Momentus executed in a binding agreement to acquire Poolworks Germany LTD. Poolworks is one of the largest social media companies in Europe with its social networks, Study VZ and Mean VZ, or it's basically Mean, Main, M E I N VZ, for 10 million in preferred stock. The study, study VZ platform was founded in 2005, 2005 in Berlin, Berlin and received capital from Lukas Gadawaski and George von Halbrink Publishing Group and the Samware Brothers. It was acquired along with MenVs by George V. von Hasbrink Publishing Group in 2007 for 85 million euros. Mm. And then by financer Michael Pope and Adam Levin in 2012. 
Today, Study VZ and Main VZ have more than 10 million registered users and over 45 million page impressions per month, largely in the German-speaking countries of Germany, Switzerland, and Australia. So that that's that press release. I mean, it keeps going on and on. Right. So. All right. Well, hey, you guys heard it. I mean, you just we see now why there was a, you know, a, not necessarily the reason why, but I mean, it definitely probably influenced the, the the run yesterday. So keep an eye on it. Like I said, you're starting to see it pull back. I, I talked about it right in the beginning of the video. Um, I, I I try to try to I, I'd like to keep it good news all the time, right? So, you know, when we're doing the videos, but you're watching this thing flicker through where it is. I, I'm not saying that it's going to drop down, uh, you know, a ton. But what I'm saying is that it's going to probably pull back a little bit. Uh, maybe trade sideways before it starts making its leg, uh, leg up because it had such a big day. Uh, but that gap up today, you know, people are like, oh, I, you know, I wish my stock would just, you know, gap and run, gap and run. You hear that term a lot, don't you? It's not really that good when it comes to uh, the analysis of it. Okay, It's, it's really not. Because then you have a stock price that's essentially way down here and then it goes way up here. And then there's this big empty void. Uh, I'm just telling you guys how I see it. Like I said, that is stock ticker symbol MMEG. Head over to investorshangout.com uh, and see what the others are saying.